everyone talking about Vlad Dracul by 1692. The notes in this are Carpathian, fir needle, red cedar, black amber, black patchouli, scorched earth, opium, and blood musk. Uh, this is earthy and coniferous at the same time. Sometimes fragrances are more like coniferous with like a tiny bit of, you know, drop of earth or like mostly earthy and then maybe a little bit of woods or something. But yeah, this definitely has that like fresh, slightly sweet, coniferous kind of fur balsam style, and then plenty of like earthy sort of soil. It's also musky, but in a very clean musk type of way. Yeah, very vivid soil accord, but still wearable, I think, if you like earthy fragrances for sure. To me, that can be a bit of a rare combination to find something that has like a really vivid soil accord, but is also wearable enough that it doesn't just feel like, well, that's really artistic and cool, but I don't wear earthy scents either way, just not for me and it doesn't go well with my skin, but I think this is a really, really wearable one. Yeah, very high quality, evocative, intriguing. Um, I just do not re recommend ordering directly from 1692. They are known for either taking months to ship and lying about it or just taking people's money and never shipping. But the best way that if you wanna try this, you could get it is to check the subreddits for fragrance swap and then on Sundays for indie makeup and more. That one has a sale throughout every Sunday where people post like indie fragrance samples that they have for and bottles that they have for sale. People are often posting 1692 stuff there. Uh, and yeah, lastly, this has moderate projection longevity and is very unisex, I would say. Um, if you've tried it, let me know what you think.